This is the verse of the day, read from God's Word Version. May you be blessed as you receive it. Good morning and welcome to the verse of the day. Today's verse from God's Word Version is Psalm 19, verse 14, which reads, May the words from my mouth and the thoughts from my heart be acceptable to you, O Lord, my rock and my defender. Often the words that come out of my mouth may not be nice. When I'm alone, and that's when my honest thoughts and words come out. Sometimes I'm so bold as to speak them out. The thoughts sometimes are worse. When my passions are aroused, my thoughts can go from one extreme to the other, like changing channels on a wild TV. Uh, And sometimes we honestly don't know how to tune out those thoughts and all that noise that comes out of our souls. It really takes focus and meditation on God's words. And that's what David is doing here in this psalm. David is a great journal writer. All the psalms are journal entries that teach us how to focus and how to track our thoughts so that we can recapture the peace that surpasses all understanding. Here in this psalm, David focuses on the glorious creation of God, on the sun in this particular psalm. And then he switches to God's words. He says God's teachings are like the sun. Nothing can escape their effect on man. Just like the sun makes us rejoice, God's words can make you rejoice, can make your eyes shine, as he says in verse 8. And it can make you wise, as he says in verse 7. Our passions and thoughts, devoid of wisdom, lead us down a really dark path. And we need God's word to tune us into that capacity for peace, wisdom, and understanding we can have as human beings created in God's image. David says that we need to desire, though, God's teachings even more than gold. They need to become more real to us, even than the material things we can touch, taste, hear, and see. Uh, God's teachings warn us from the doom that we will surely encounter if We ignore God's teachings. Only God can help us gain control from our sins and from our wayward thoughts. Although David, way back when he wrote this, didn't know about the Messiah, he knew, though, that God had the power to forgive us. As Christians, we know that in Christ, we've been forgiven. We've been cleansed from past sins, so there's nothing that needs to haunt us anymore. There are no things from the past that could bring us noise. It's all gone in Jesus Christ. We've been able to hit the reset button so we can now climb our way out of darkness into the light of Christ and have his light shine in us. And then we can truly say, as David said in Psalm 19, 14, may the words from my mouth and the thoughts from my heart be acceptable to you, O Lord, my rock and my defender. Have a great day. I pray you have been blessed by the insight you received from today's verse of the day. Walk with the Lord and be a blessing.